Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we are back in the Polish campaign. Let's get right into it. The Battle of Brest. Oh, whoa. <laughs> you shouldn't have. Alright, well, wow, the Germans don't even have enough troops to defend down here. Well, you know what we're gonna do, ladies and gentlemen. You know what has to be done. It's rocket time. We are gonna have some bunkers, so we're gonna do that as well. Get my rocket boys to hit this building immediately. Oh boy, our rocket just yeeted itself. That was great. <laughs> but I have faith. Wow, we're doing a lot of damage in center. All right, there goes their VIP building. Easy enough. And there's their last VIP right there. We've actually done so well, we wiped out all of their tank forces. Their VIP building is a pan- our tank is a Panzer One. Now that isn't good for the German morale. This was driving around as my- oh, it's already dead. I was just gonna make a joke how it was driving around and I blink and it's dead. Come on. Come on, Germans, you can do better than this. I mean, if I was a German and I was losing to Poland, I would just surrender immediately and just start deserting the army, to be honest. This is kind of sad, champ. I want to see this boy. This boy looks funny. All right, so we have the next battles here. We have a death match and a death match. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm seeing this and I'm like, let's just go right into it. I ain't even waiting around. I'm seeing buildings. Let's take them out. We have a little German airfield here. Oh no, they have rock. Oh, what, a tiger? In I guess they would have tigers by this point. Honestly, German engineering is probably making up something to stop us, so I wouldn't be surprised to see super weapons in the next mission. I feel like that's subtle foreshadowing, ladies and gentlemen. I feel like they're actually going to have super weapons. All right, we're actually going to try to test the German with medium tanks this time. Never want to take the German's head on, though, so we are going to have some rockets. Kind of like this. We really want to take out that building ASAP. We're going to shove... When I mean shove, we're putting bunkers right in the walkways of these Germans. So as soon as they come up, they're just going to be bunker spammed. As an absolute meme fest, of course. And we're also going to get some armored cars, because these Germans need to learn how to turn around. We want rockets to hit this airfield immediately. See, the devs never intended for unit orders, so it does make these missions a little bit easier. But these are still insanely difficult. Alright, let's go. And there's the building. Perfect! That was pretty easy. Alright, we got that done. And the Germans are getting stuck by our bunkers, which is exactly what I wanted for Christmas. That's working pretty well. This Tiger is actually Cal, it's dead now. I was going to say it was tanking rockets, but it wasn't tanking- Oh, our rockets just killed our units! Oh, that wasn't nice. Why did you just do that? Ooh, that hit hard. Well, they have a few tank units that I'm not very excited about that are actually getting through right now. We are hitting a few of them, though. They don't have many left. Yeah, that's it. That didn't last long for them. Our artillery saves the day again. I'm pretty sure if we didn't have artillery, this would be impossible. I don't even know how it would be possible. Oh, don't let him repair. Get him, boys. There you go. All right, we have the last Germans here. All right, I think this is literally the last German. He doesn't have a single bit of ammo. He actually tanked an artillery shell. Oh, no, he didn't. He's dead. That was the last German. All right, victory. All right, we've reached the final mission of the campaign, ladies and gentlemen. This is it for all the oysters and the clams. Now we can get some big boy officer tanks. Oh, don't get it for him. Don't get it for him. Let's get it for them. We got some big boy officer tanks coming in. And we kind of want to buff their damage. So we're actually going to give them 80 damage. As any campaign must end, we must have 80 damage officers. Enemy secret weapons in 1939. Ladies and gentlemen, I think they're going to bring out the nukes on us. I mean, if the Polish have done this well in 1939, I I don't even I don't even know if this would be remembered in the history books. I mean, this is just sad. Winter Hills. All right. Whew. Trying to think of a strategy. What could they possibly have as a secret unit? Oh boy. Are those jet planes? They are not. Where are these secret units? Oh, the artillery. Oh no, they're not messing around this time. They got all the stops. If I were a secret unit, where would I be placed? Oh, maybe they're gonna come out of the factory. That's probably where they're gonna be. Yeah, because I'm not seeing any secret units right now. So we have a couple trench ways they can get through. I think we ram some bunkers here. We're mainly gonna have some rockets firing here. And for the frontal artillery, we want artillery right up here, right on the top. Light tanks holding the line. We're gonna have them all over the place. I mean, it, you thought light tanks were ridiculous at first, ladies and gentlemen. You ain't seen nothing yet. And we're kind of, if, we, if it leads to that point, we will actually put the Germans in a death trap. We do want the artillery advantage, so I am gonna spread out some more artillery everywhere. And we mainly wanna take out those VIP buildings if we can very urgently. And we're actually gonna bring in the mobile artillery don't worry, I didn't forget it again. I'm not small brain. We got three of them. We're gonna put a bunker back here, but honestly, if it gets this far, we're doomed. We have artillery squadron number uno. Please take out this tank producing building. And we have rocket squadron uno 76. Take out the building, and then we are ready to go. I'm gonna leave it on this map mode. It's a little easier for us to see the final match of the campaign. 
All right, so center is going very well. Center, they're getting wiped. Their building is about to be wiped out. Their building is out, and they have two more VIP buildings and trucks. Their south looks like they got wiped out. We still have unit advantage. Don't count the Germans out yet. They're coming in hard. Okay, we have, they actually are kind of getting around these mountain passes. They're actually shooting up these guns. Our tanks are fighting their tanks in the center here. Oh, it's a hard match. You don't have artillery support. Those tanks are going to ram through. But they have no reinforcements, so even if they do, they're going to run into the bunkers that we have. Oh, no, they're down. Oh, that's what I was afraid of. We are going to have to use this reserve bunker that we have. Oh, no. All right, maybe we can take out their tanks. Okay, we're doing it kind of. Come on, boys. There we go. One out, two out. They only have a few more tanks left. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, I am feeling a victory. Something we've achieved together. We've achieved the impossible. Oh, what is happening here? Oh, this VIP building is... This truck is alone. This tank's alone. He's about to be artillery to death. There we go. What? Is that it? Victory! Yes! That's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Here from our friend here. Oh. It's a solemn moment for me too. Oh. Let's watch the last little ending screen here. And we are oh, Major General. We didn't get the best. I missed one little victory, but that's okay. We don't need it. Let's finish the campaign here, ladies and gentlemen. For the last time, this is it. This is it for right now. Is there anything else beyond the credits? Beyond, well, the black screen of death? Nope, that is it. But I wanted to say thank you guys so much for sticking around. If you guys have been here since the German campaign, you're old and you've been here for a while, but I like you and I respect you. And I thank you so much for sticking with me through all of these campaigns. Look at this. Let's go back here and look at them all. Look at all these bad boys. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. There was six at the original. And I predict there'll probably will be a Japanese campaign or something, but even so, thank you guys for sticking around. And you guys are awesome. I hope you stick around in the future. To the sandbox mode we go, or the workshop. Maybe there'll be a few things out, who knows. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button, the subscribe button, and don't forget to check out the rest of my videos.